Well, hello everyone. It's February 22nd, 2023 in Big Bear. It's about 10.30 in the morning. Or actually it is 10.30 in the morning, not about 10.30. And uh, we have, it's just starting to flurry a little bit. It started flurrying at the house, snow flurries. And I hope you guys are enjoying the fact that you have the option to hop onto the live feed to see what's going on with this storm. I think that's freaking awesome. But uh, yeah. You know what, we're gonna take the back roads and go back the other direction because that's where the big clouds were. Oh, it's so pretty out here. Hey, dude. <laughs> Thank you guys for all the support. I appreciate it a lot. I really do. This is so much fun to do for you guys because you guys are so loving and so kind. And uh, yeah, this next part of the storm, this is, this is the beginning of the end for us in Big Bear. <laughs> Kiss Big Bear goodbye, folks. Kiss Big Bear goodbye. Kiss my butt goodbye, my friend. These steep little hills are nothing for me. I own these hills. I owns it. All right. So we're gonna turn left here on Oak. Then kind of come back out around. That's a really steep hill right there, though. I don't think I want to try that one at the moment. Okay, so we're going to go into Moon Ridge and find this new snow. There's a couple flurries, as you can see, blowing from that big cloud over there. This storm really wants to open up. So I heard a, uh, the, the San Gabriel's got a blizzard warning. Do you remember, you guys, I was telling you guys that that's my prediction for up here is that it'll be our first blizzard warning of the season. <coughs> we still haven't been issued a blizzard warning, but we shall see. It is still early. And uh, let's see here. Twenty one degrees, it's cold out here. Ten thirty in the morning. Remember what I told you guys about the GPS thing? I'm glad I learned how to do it, but the issue is it takes forever to upload the videos if I have the GPS attached to my video. I mean, it takes over twice as much time. So I know you guys, when you wanna see what's going on right away, you don't wanna wait four hours to see what's going on. So that's the issue. So when you look at the map, on the top it says what street we're on. So we're on Brownie Lane. But yeah guys, I hope you're enjoying the live feed that I have up. I want you guys to know that I'll, 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 I'll be doing other live feeds too. Um, this one's gonna, I'm, I, I'm gonna try and keep it up for the whole entire storm. I've charged three external, like really heavy duty power banks. So when our power goes out, I'll still be able to keep that live on. The only problem is at nighttime, we're not gonna have any lights outside if the power goes out. So it'll be hard to see, but I think you guys will still appreciate feeling like you're here watching it. We're 
getting some snowflakes. We're getting some snowflakes. As you guys know, as soon as it starts snowing, I come back out. Like, that's what I do. Oops, there we go. Snow Summit is just to the right of us. Just to the right. Cheerio. Yeah, we're definitely getting some light snowflakes. I'm sure you guys can definitely see them. So here's Snow Summit. They're not gonna let us through, but we're gonna be able to get this view over here. Wow, snow is definitely starting to come down. Now we're on Summit Boulevard. So keep your fingers crossed, guys, that we get our blizzard warning. I'm still confident that it's gonna happen, that my prediction will come to fruition. Because it did on the other mountain range, so that's good. And usually we get hit harder for, for some, some odd reason. Okay, we're on a street called Evergreen. <laughs> Excuse me. Evergreen. I love the snow. And look at this blue skies up there and it's snowing right here. <laughs> that is so cool. These blue skies are gonna be black momentarily. This is Apple's bed and breakfast straight ahead. Sorry about that. We just went through the first roundabout. Look at these, look at these huge clouds up here. We're gonna take a journey through Bear, up to Bear and then back around. Oh, here's the snow. Look at that. It's definitely coming down over there by, by Bear Mountain. Check this out, you guys. You can see it dumping over there. I don't know if you guys can, but you can see it really coming down over there. It almost feels like 
we're on an airplane driving through like in between the clouds, but you can still see a whole bunch of snow. Oh, it's so beautiful. Here's our beautiful golf course. Just got dark, just got dark. In just a second, I'm gonna pan the camera up and we're not gonna be able to see any sun. kid when we would come up here to go skiing and, and snowboarding I would uh, I would just love to watch the clouds roll over the top of Bear Mountain like when we'd get a little break in the storm it would be blue skies and then instantaneously it was cloudy it was it and the clouds just are blowing so fast over the mountain it's so awesome There's beautiful bear. Free sledding location, stay on this road here to the right and can go all the way to the top and you're there. tell because this parking lot's empty so that's a good thing for those of you who want to come up skiing and snowboarding the next couple days are gonna be great for y'all I mean if you can make it if you can make it yeah we got some, some good snow coming down here crazy and go up into upper moon ridge uh, on the next part of the storm that is going to be a bit crazy because it's really dangerous to drive up and down into upper moon ridge but i want you guys to see the snow discrepancy from up there to down here they usually get a lot more snow up there from this inch of snow we got down here they probably have two inches up there i know that that's not that much but it's double what we got down here And it's not even that high of an elevation change. Once again, we're passing the golf course to the left. Oh, look at that view though, that's so pretty.
snowblower out. Yeah. It's a little guy. A little tiny snowblower. That's us in the Big Bear area. You get an inch of snow, they bring out the heavy equipment. satellite parking lots for bear I remember as a little kid we would park there a lot and take the tram over to bear it's great memories that's why I moved up here entire family got along really well and it wasn't so full of narcissistic sociopaths those were the good memories of my life yeah we're back on moon ridge you guys and it is 19 degrees 10 48 in the morning so thank you guys again for everything thank you for your support i appreciate it um if you guys are in, enjoying this, please like and subscribe and help me out. I appreciate it. I'm going to be out here through the whole storm, kicking butt and taking names. So thank you guys again for everything. And it's February 22nd, 2023, and I will talk to you guys later. Love you guys. Peace out.